Imagine a sky filled with sleek, stealthy fighter jets, escorted by swarms of autonomous drones. This isn't a scene from a sci-fi movie. It's the future of the United States Air Force. Welcome to the realm of the Next Generation Air Dominance Program, or NGAD for short. As the U.S. Air Force looks to the future, it's clear that maintaining air superiority is more critical than ever. With China and Russia rapidly advancing their fighter capabilities, the U.S. must stay ahead of the game. That's where NGAD comes in, a program designed to replace the iconic F-22 fighter jets by 2030 and ensure continued American dominance in the skies. But what exactly is NGAD and why is it so important? Is it just another expensive toy for the military or could it revolutionize the way we think about air superiority? Let's dive in and find out. The NGAD program isn't just about building a fancy new plane. It's a complete overhaul of how we think about aerial warfare. Instead of relying on a single platform, the Air Force is adopting a system of systems approach. This could mean anything from a single revolutionary aircraft to a combination of manned, unmanned, semi-autonomous escort aircraft known as Collaborative Combat Aircraft, or CCAs. These CCA drones, estimated to cost around $30 million each, will perform a variety of roles, from sensing and jamming to carrying additional munitions and even attacking targets on their own. In other words, forget your typical dogfighting scenes from Top Gun, the future of air combat might look very different. At the heart of this network-connected family of systems is the sixth-generation fighter aircraft. Shrouded in secrecy, the Air Force plans to replace the Raptor with the NGAD fighter, and they're not messing around. They want 200 of these bad boys, along with a whopping 1,000 unmanned collaborative combat aircraft. That's a lot of firepower. So what kind of futuristic tech is NGAD cooking up? While the Air Force is keeping most of the details under wraps, we do know a few tantalizing tidbits. For starters, they're working on some seriously impressive propulsion systems, like variable cycle engines that can generate more electrical power while keeping things cool. Companies like Pratt and Whitney and General Electric are locked in a high-stakes battle to develop the most advanced engines the world has ever seen. But that's not all. NGAD is also pushing the boundaries of materials science with advanced composites that could make these new aircraft lighter, stronger, and stealthier than ever before. And don't even get me started on the sensors. We're talking radar, infrared, and electro-optical systems that would make James Bond's gadgets look like kids' toys. Of course, all this cutting-edge tech doesn't come cheap. The Air Force is projected to spend a whopping $11.7 billion on NGAD between 2024 and 2027 alone. But hey, can you really put a price on total air dominance? With so much money and brain power being poured into NGAD, you might be wondering, who's actually working on this stuff? While the Air Force is keeping its cards close to its chest, we do know that industry heavyweights like Lockheed Martin and Boeing are expected to be the top contenders for NGAD contracts. But the program is also shaking things up by splitting design, production, and sustainment contracts, opening the door for smaller, innovative companies to get in on the action. So, when can we expect to see these futuristic fighter jets taking to the skies? Well, for the next few years, NGAD will continue as a research effort with plans to start acquiring production aircraft around 2030. But even then, it could take several more years to get everything up and running, thanks to the complex manufacturing processes involved. The good news is that the Air Force is already making progress. They've flown a full-scale flight demonstrator. We've already built and flown a full-scale flight demonstrator in the real world, and we broke records in doing it. This year, they expect to award development contracts to two companies for the NGAD fighter and three for the CCA drones. It's like a high-stakes competition where the winners get to shape the future of air combat. In the end, NGAD is more than just a fighter jet program. It's a glimpse into the future of air combat. With its cutting-edge technologies, innovative acquisition strategies, and bold vision for air superiority, NGAD is poised to keep the U.S. at the forefront of military aviation for decades to come.